Well, hello! How's it going, guys? Yes, I did it. I finally made the video. <laughs> I made a Halo Reach video, uh, and I really wanted to do this one. Um, <laughs> I said I was going to make a video, like, um, either on the what day, uh, 14th, 15th, or 16th. I was going to make one on the 15th, but then I started playing campaign at like 9 o'clock, and I didn't, I didn't stop playing that until I went to bed. And then I was like, alright, alright, gotta make a video, gotta make a video, and I said that on the 16th, and then my, uh, I was playing, it was like 6 o'clock, and my friend's like, oh, uh, yeah, wanna play some Firefight? I'm like, okay, he's like, uh, do you wanna go for the million point challenge? I'm like, uh, okay, might as well get it. Took four hours. <laughs> it took like four hours to get. Oh my god, I wanted to kill myself after the second hour. <laughs> Man, but like the feeling of getting that achievement done and not having to do it ever again. <sighs> Alright, anyway, so enough of that. Enough for the prelude to this. Here it is, my first uh, gameplay that I am posting of Halo Reach. I did have one beta video though. And uh, it's not a great match. Score wise, I suppose, because like you know, C Nanners posts like you know a perfection, and obviously that's a pretty high kill death ratio. <laughs> but uh, this is pretty good. There's a funny moment. I get a funny death later on. Um, but I think it's pretty good. You know, I get quite a few kills. Um, almost half the team's kills. Uh, it's really hard when you think like, what is considered a good game in Halo? I mean, that's a pretty hot topic, I, I uh, suppose. But I suppose if you get almost half your team's kills, then you must be doing something right. <laughs> but, uh, so this is the, this is one of my favorite maps that I've played so far. I've played about 10 to 15 multiplayer games, about 15 multiplayer games. I've played two on the, no, three on the cage, and two out of the three I've done really well. In fact, I was debating whether or not to post this, or post this, to like my guys, you know, like my, so. I was deciding if I should post this or a different gameplay also on the cage. And I just chose this one because it was Slayer DMRs. And uh, <laughs> so far for Halo Reach, oh my god this game is amazing. <laughs> if you do not have this game, I feel really sorry for you. I really do. <laughs> And here's where, here's the fun. Okay, so I think I paused a little bit earlier because my dad was, I remember this, my dad called me on the phone, so I picked up the phone and uh, went to talk to him, so I was trying to play while talking on the phone, so I wasn't really paying attention, and uh, I sprinted right off the map. Didn't even know that was possible, but I sprinted right off the map. So there is one of my deaths right there, and of course it subtracts one from your score. But uh, <laughs> anyway, hey, this game is amazing. I'm just gonna, for the sake of argument, I'm gonna compare it to Modern Warfare 2 and like how much more depth and how great this game is so far. Modern Warfare 2. It has three things: campaign, spec ops, and multiplayer. Halo Reach has uh, campaign, multiplayer, firefight, forge, and theater. Campaign, I appreciate the Halo campaign a lot. Call of Duty campaigns, there's no like, the, the only, only Modern Warfare 2 had like a story to the past, but it still didn't really relate that much. <laughs> like. Sure, the call like the events in Call of Duty 4 led up to the events in Modern Warfare 2, but there weren't really like any characters except well, that's kind of a lie. To be honest, that's actually quite a huge lie. But it just felt different. Like um, it just wasn't connected at all. I don't know. I'm not really a. <laughs> I suppose I'm not really an expert on stories. So, but anyway, the Halo campaign. Um, I, I, every Halo game is great campaign-wise. To be honest. Every game in its own right has a great campaign. So there's always that going for it for Halo. Matchmaking, multiplayer. Of course, you know, what? it's Halo. I mean, do I really need to say more? I mean, I love the multiplayer in this game already. As you see me, uh, <laughs> that's pretty... I wouldn't run into the middle of a map with a shotgun. 
so take note of that. <laughs> Probably gonna die. But if matchmaking, it's it's amazing. I love the DMR. I love the sniper. Grenades are weakened. The only thing I hate about the multiplayer is that people are on beta hangover and all they do is spam grenades. <laughs> that guy falls off the map. Like I did earlier. The grenades aren't as good as in the beta from what I've seen so far. So that's good. I'm glad Bungie did that. You know, hear that Infinity Ward and Trey well, Trey R kinda does, but hear that Infinity Ward, Infinity Ward? They listen to their community. I I know, it's just I've, I've never seen before, but <laughs> just an idea. Anyway, so yes, matchmaking, fantastic. Uh, firefight. Um, I, I like firefight. It's a great add-on to the game. You know, you can't go wrong with it. A lot of people like it. I'm not that big of a fan of firefight, but it's fun. And you know, with the online matchmaking for firefight now, that's cool. So yeah, I mean, you know, that's w it's way better than Spec Ops in comparison to Modern Warfare 2. I did not really play Spec Ops at all in Modern Warfare 2. Just couldn't get into it. Really, no reward for anything. Just uh, no, not for me. Um, and of course, oh my God, Forge. Okay, Forge is my favorite part of the game right now. <laughs> I'm gonna. I. I love forge so far i didn't and this is i did not forge much even if at all uh during halo 3 i did not forge whatsoever i forged a little bit at the end just like you know fooling around and stuff and playing with friends first thing one of the first things i did in halo reach was try out the forge because i wanted to see what it was like and i built a map for two and a half hours <laughs> Which I'm still working on and I might finish it. Hopefully I do. And I'll have to show you one time. Hopefully I can finish it and I can... You know, even if it's not finished, I can give you like a fly around of a map I'm making in Forge. And hopefully I won't get like... Hopefully I'll get less than four comments telling me how sucky it is. <laughs> if it's under four, then that's a success. So Forge is awesome. You know, it's, it's so much more expanded in Halo 3. Because I read up on it, you know, Halo 3 Forge was meant to make or meant uh, for making small uh, changes in already existing maps and of course Bungie didn't anticipate how much forge would be used and the stuff that would come out of it now it's suited to people now you can literally build great maps just using forge I mean you know of like like 15 I don't know how many maps are in the game like 15 that you can play in matchmaking like four of those are built with forge by Bungie that's when you know you have something going right. Like like the cage. As you can probably tell, this map is entirely made from Forge. Using the Forge. And I love it. A couple of my friends don't like it, but <laughs> I like it. So, I, Forge is so awesome, it's ridiculous. And, uh... <laughs> seriously, if you don't have this game, you need to get it. Please get it. <laughs> um... Yeah, it's it's really amazing. And, uh, yeah, I don't know what else there really is to say. I mean, there's a lot to say, but I only have, like, a minute left, and uh, I can't really uh, talk about it, you know, talk about much more in this video. But uh, maybe I will in a future video. I'm sure I will. I'll, I'm sure I'll talk a lot more about this game in a future video. But, uh, oh, also on another note, my last video, <laughs> my Call of Duty 4 video, which came out on the day that Rele uh, Reach came out, probably not a good idea. Uh, that had like no views, so that sucks. But, which is a shame, because I thought that was one of my better commentaries. But, I'm probably not going to make many Call of Duty games, or Call of Duty videos, in the future. Like, up until Black Ops comes out, it's going to be a majority of Halo Reach. Because I freaking love this game. <laughs> I mean, every once in a while, I'll release a Modern Warfare 2 video. But, uh, expect a lot of the videos to be from Halo Reach. So that's it guys, final score like 23 kills and 6 deaths. Thanks for watching the video guys, I love you all, goodbye.